Hello my friends, today I'm going to tame Hesperornis. So I didn't plan to tame Hesperornis, but I just found one in front of my house, so I thought, why not? I didn't know exactly how to tame it, but I realized that I need to build up some kind of trap so that it stays inside and is quite safe. But it was quite naughty. Look at it. It's running after me and it tries to pinch me and and then it goes away. But I did lock it even though it tried to escape and it took me just 20 minutes to fix it and I finally did it. Okay, gotcha. So now it's not gonna go anywhere, it's quite safe, and I can go and do some fishing. In order to tame a Hesperornis, you need to fish and uh, bring the dead corpses um, of the fish to the Hesperornis and then feed it. It, so it's nice if you have a uh, lake or river next to your place, at least to the teaming place. But I think you can find his is next to the rivers and oceans, so it's not a problem. The door was quite narrow, so I dropped the fish a few times, and every time I dropped it, the bird tried to eat it off the ground. Otherwise, it would start to attack me, and yeah, here we go. So, it must be fed out of your hands, otherwise it's not counted as uh, taming. What is this? All right, it must be a special brand of fish that can fly even after it's dead. Feeling comfortable there. Yeah, it was a fat one, so that's bad that I lost it. You can bring fish or like other kinds of like piranhas, but don't go for turtles. <laughs> it's not gonna work out. Oh, I dropped it again. That was a long fishing day and uh, somewhere in the middle I, I got so tired and I was sweating. <laughs> so I had a feeling that I simply want to kill it. I didn't dare. The taming process wasn't going too fast. It was quite slow and I I got hurt a lot and I was alone to tame it. Therefore it was a bit complicated but if you have a tribe uh, mate that's gonna make it much easier because you can both fish and so if it if you get bored, you can always play with the fish, you can even make fish cutlets. I don't think the fish would mind eating it as well. And the, the bigger fish you get, the faster the process of taming is gonna be. This is the last fish that I killed for taming. My metal pike was broken, so I just used the axe. I had no energy to go and fix the <laughs> pike. And finally, I tamed it. Here we go. Oh, it's, it is dizzy. I put it on my shoulder and as for me, it just looks like a golf club case. It's a nice pet. You can run with it and jump and hopefully <laughs> it won't be a burden on your shoulder. 
you can even swim with this and maybe it's gonna show you the way where to swim and where the fish is I want more fish no you are grounded today you pinched me so many times but I want more fish very difficult so if you really want to go for a Hesperonis good luck with that as for me the only thing I need to do now is just to wait till it can give me the first golden egg hopefully it won't take me long that's all for today so thanks for watching and see you next time